Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to the pixellab.net. Today I want to talk a little bit about body paint. Now, I haven't really spent too much time with body paint and uh, I'm trying to learn it more and more. Let's go ahead and show you one cool thing you can do with it. So if we go to layout under window and then we go to BP 3D paint, it's going to open up all these different options. And uh, if you're just beginning Cinema 4D, um, you might not have uh, kind of jumped over into body paint too much. And uh, when you do, it is a little bit daunting. There are a lot of different options in here. Um, you can sort of think about this as uh, the Photoshop part of Cinema 4D, where you can have a lot of the different uh, features that Photoshop has and be able to paint on different textures. Well, one cool thing that I figured out was if you go to your Brushes tab and you go to File, you can actually load .abr brush files from Photoshop. So if you go ahead and go to your um, Photoshop CS5 presets brushes, there's all these .abr files. And a lot of these come with Photoshop, but I have a few extra ones that I found online that I've added. So let's go ahead and open up this guy. And it's going to go ahead and bring in all of your brushes, which is really, really cool. So then what we can do is just double click on one of these guys and you have all of your brush settings up here. So the way that we can add a simple brush to something like a cube is this button up here, which is called the Paint Setup Wizard. So if we click on this once, it's going to kind of walk us through a really quick setup process. And it's going to put the, uh, the texture on the object. You can also just put on the material. We'll go ahead and put it on the cube that I have. And then all of these guys, I'm just going to leave default, hit next. And right here is your material options. And this is going to be where that uh, brush preset is going to go. If it goes in your alpha channel, let's actually go ahead and put it in our color channel. And uh, we can change that to something blue like that. And then go ahead and hit finish. And then the body paint setup wizard is done. And now if we go ahead and make sure we're on our brush, you can see that we're able to just click and add a brush to our cube, right? Really, really fast way to add a little bit of texturing uh, to one of your objects. If you have some grunge brushes, just one simple click, kind of uh, paint around some grunge. It's a really, really cool way to add some, uh, some details. And then all you have to do is go to Window, Layout, go back to your standard, and you'll notice that it created a new texture with uh, that graffiti texture in the color channel. So that is just a really quick thing that you can do uh, with body paint, sort of a simple way to add stickers or uh, brush presets, grunge, all that kind of business. So I hope that uh, kind of opens up some possibilities for you. Like I said, body paint is uh, it's pretty daunting. So uh, maybe this is a simple way where you can jump in and start playing around with it. And uh, man, there are just so many possibilities once you start playing around with it. So go have fun and we'll talk again soon. Bye everybody.